Hi, John Hans Connect here. Um, a while last year I made a video about my world's smallest plasma cutter. And um, just as a quick background, I, I bought a cheap um, laser engraver that has the blue diode. And I 3D printed my own plasma torch head um, carrier to add to that. I don't use torch height control because I index my plates at a specific height every time and the plates are repeatable um, but last year when I made my video I was quite happy with the cut quality out of this thing um, and that's what it looked like on the back now you can see there's a little bit of dross um, but I I figured well these are painted steel plates that I'm cutting it's not going to be perfect but now I have it down to this um, and the way I solved the issue which this is really close to laser quality except for where the start is I need a longer lead-in for my starts uh, because you can see a slight burn mark um, but this this doesn't affect it at all these are really good quality now and I'll tell you what I did I had initially used the cheap uh, Chinese controllers for X and Y stepper motors those are NEMA 17's and these are just like the stepper motor controllers you'd find for a 3D printer I um, rebuilt it and I put some uh, Keeling Technology DSP controllers in a little case and now I can really up my cut speed to uh, 3,000 millimeters per minute. Um, and the cut quality is just insane. I'll go ahead and demonstrate. Turn on it's my dryer that I built it on top of. Uh, what else? This is my Cut 50L plasma cutter. 30 amps. These plates are one millimeter thickness, and I use a, it's essentially a um, torch head, it's a hypertherm torch head, but it's made in China, uh, so I built it myself, buying the parts, and it uses the fine cut consumables, because they are, they're basically hypertherm consumables. So I think I'm ready to give it a shot, let's give it a and go ahead and hit start. that fan so it was uh, it needed more speed and those little um, stepper drivers that are made for 3d printers just couldn't handle the torque of uh, moving the head around anyway I'm really happy with it it's really close to laser quality all right bye